All right, all right, all right. Let's do something else. We want to look at a great question. How do you do rich text editing with React Native? Now, if you go to GitHub um, and you search for hmm, Draft.js React Native, you will find different libraries. Um, however, I used one of these uh, for a personal project. Uh, right here, right? As you can see, it's private, so I'm not going to talk about that. Um, I believe it was by a gentleman called Danny Akash. Draft is. Hmm. Oh, I see. It was taken over. Ah, I see. He changed it completely. And now it's a public archive. But I use this for olog.me um, to enable mentions, etc. Yeah. Ooh, this project is not actually maintained. There's an implementation for TypeScript and for support, but not published. If you need help, reach out to me on Twitter. Okay. So basically what it does is run uh, Facebook's Draft.js project um, in, in uh, a web view for your React Native app. Um, so there you have it. Uh, what I did for my personal project was to look at the source code for this uh, Draft.js editor for React Native and pull out quite a few things. Now, if I could do it again, if I could do this again, I would use a different library, pardon me while I, while I close these. I would use a different library, a different tool. Um, let me see uh, React Native Mentions, because mentions were the most important thing I wanted, really. Let's see Mentions. Filter or filter? Sure, Expogo, please. Uh, it did not find anything. That is odd. Ah, I see a mod in the home. Okay. Mentions. Ah, this guy. Controlled mentions. Right. If I were to do it again, so this has 300 stars, 643 downloads, 22,000 downloads. I believe it's this gentleman right here. I'll do this because it's native, like truly native. It came out after I implemented my own solution, but for rich text editing, right, in React Native, that boils down to basically just making sure, like things like website URLs, highlight mentions, add mentions with suggestions come up, and hashtags are clickable, whatever you want, basically. I would use this. Yeah, I would definitely use this. There's a lot of libraries here and there. You can go around, you can search, you can fork. Basically, it's up to you, but I feel if I could do it again for Olog, I would do this. Now, this video has gone on way longer than I wanted, but it's unscripted, so that's it. Bye.